Hello, I'm Darian Torok here, Media Arts Student at the CTA Academy. Thank you for joining us for this District News Minute. If you can believe it, holiday season is upon us. Our students at Roosevelt High School are celebrating early as the Rough Riders were one of the 56 schools from across the country chosen to create one-of-a-kind ornaments to be sent to Washington, D.C. to be displayed next to the National Christmas Tree for thousands to see. These handcrafted ornaments will adorn 56 smaller trees next to the national tree, which represent each U.S. state territory and the District of Columbia as part of the American Celebrates display. The theme for these handcrafted ornaments is the celebration of which the state they have come from. Students created everything from South Dakota landscapes and cityscapes to a representation of the ongoing school rivalry between SCSU and USD. Art teacher Lisa Dredd said it's a great showcase to bring art outside of the school and outside of the city and the state and I'm proud to have Roosevelt art students represented in the Washington DC on the South Dakota tree. The national tree is set to be lit on November 28th with the 96th annual National Christmas Tree lighting ceremony. In other feel-good news, mark your calendars. The date for the 13th annual Project Warm Up has been set. This year's Project Warm Up will take place on Saturday, December 8th at Sonia Sotomayor Elementary School from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. Project Warm Up was started in 2006 by Sonia Sotomayor Principal Tracy Fick and her daughter Caitlin. Caitlin wanted to create a service project for her key club at high school, Lincoln High School, and knowing the growing population of homeless students in Sioux Falls School District, they came up with the idea of making fleece-side blankets over the past 12 years. Project Warm Up has collected and distributed over 20,000 blankets to local children and families in need due to financial hardship, family tragedy, illness, loss of home due to flood, tornado, fire, poverty. Can make it to volunteer on December 8th, but want to get involved? Consider hosting a blanket making party with your club, team, youth group, book club, colleagues, class, family, or friends, or simply consider donating fleece for more information on how to get involved. Please visit our website at www.sf.k12.sd.us. Finally, we're already a quarter of the way into school year second quarter. It's here and a busy one, with things like daylight savings time, holiday parties, and winter breaks. The quarter tends to fly by while it's a fun and exciting time. It also brings its own set of challenges. To have a successful second quarter, it's important to stay on your usual routine. Superintendent Dr. Brian Meyer says, you get into a routine of the beginning of the year, and then you get in that second quarter, and there are so many things that try and knock you out of that routine. Do everything you can to really stay true to that routine. The more you can do to stay in routine, the better. Be sure to stay up on what say it by going on, following our social media channels and referring to your school's calendar, which can be found on our website at www.sf.k12.sd.us. You can learn more about initiatives, classroom projects, few fine arts performances and sporting events, and get important information for parents and students by checking out the Sioux Falls School District's cable channel, KLRN, your Sioux Falls Classroom Connection on McConnet channels 20 and 590-95 are by visiting the website at www.sf.k12.us. US. Join us each week for more news and information about your Sioux Falls schools within the District News Minute. I'm Darian Torok. Thank you for joining us.